Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am back again with another review and it's going to be on this guy here. It's the BH Cosmetics Nude Lips 28 Lipstick Palette. I'm going to leave a timeline down below just in case you're only watching this video for certain reasons like you just want to see the swatches, you don't really care what I think about it, then I'll leave a little timeline down below just in case you don't want to watch the whole video. So it just makes it easier for everyone. Yeah, I'm just not going to babble on too much. Let's just get straight on to the swatches. fifty in the US. So if you convert it to New Zealand dollars, it's about twenty ish dollars, about twenty four ish dollars. But I feel like this is totally worth it. If you're a makeup artist, then like a freelancing makeup artist, this will be so worth it. It will suit so many skin tones and the sh the variety of nudes in here. You can just transform it from bridal to dramatic clubbing makeup. You know, there's just a lot of variety in here. And even if you're not a makeup artist, I feel like you would enjoy this as well because I enjoy it and it just goes on so creamy like it's super creamy it's so pigmented well some of the shades are a bit different the formulas on every single color is not the same some go on a bit more drier not as creamy some are not as pigmented but overall for total is 50 US and you're getting 28 shadows this is a really great deal like this is super duper awesome I would really recommend this and I just I just love it. There's nothing bad I can say about it. Obviously not all 28 shades to me are perfect But for the price that I'm paying for it. I mean, I don't mind. I don't mind that there are some like Bad shades in there. So I absolutely love it and there are a bit there are more good shades than bad shades So 
majority this palette is awesome I absolutely love it this will suit so many skin tones they have a lot of cool tone based nudes and a lot of warmer tone based nudes they have your pinks your browns your berries they even have like one of a ready terracotta shape a really big range of nudes in here so I absolutely love it my type of shade so I bought this and I also did a review on this a while ago this is the Sephora like similar lip palette kind of thing and this has it's not completely nude as you can see it has some orange reds and pinks and berries in there so I bought this and I was let's be real I was kind of disappointed with it if you did watch my review on this I didn't even do a lip swatch on it I only did hand swatches because I just feel like they weren't pigmented enough like just comparing these two I would get the BH Cosmetics one and this has more shades. I feel like this only has about 20, 23-ish, 24-ish shades. So it does have a little bit less and the pan on this one is a lot bigger. You're getting more product and this is way more pigmented than this one. And this was probably double the price, I think. I think this, it wasn't, this one wasn't too expensive either. It was like probably $28 or something like that. But comparing out of these two, if you had to choose one, I would definitely get the BH Cosmetics one. The only thing I like about the Sephora one more than the BH Cosmetics one is the packaging. Um, it feels more sturdy, it's a magnetic closure, and it's just more thinner, it's just easier to carry with you rather than this big plastic one here. But, ooh, that was a nice catch. But, yeah, overall, if you're wanting quality, I would choose the BH Cosmetics one and it's a lot cheaper so yeah um, that's just my little two cents I want to compare. That is everything I've got to say about this lip palette here. I hope you guys enjoy my reviews. Please like this video for my lips because my lips went through hell yesterday. They were like literally numb from all the rubbing I did on it. Thumbs up for my efforts in my lip swatches and subscribe to my channel to see more reviews. I do reviews on different products every single week so yeah leave comments down below as well what you guys want me to swatch or what you guys want me to try out any like weird funky stuff then I really want to try it because I'm like really interested in buying that kind of stuff so I really want to try things and new things out for you guys so you guys don't need to spend your money if it sucks I can just spend the money for you guys so you know we can kind of have that kind of relationship but that is everything like comment subscribe and until next time I'll see you guys in my next video I am back again with another. I was gonna say, Daniel, Daniel, back it again with the white bands. Swatching all 28 shadows. Shadows.